How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of Stay of the K2. So if you guys saw in the last video, I finally got my hacker. In fact, this is actually Tomiko. Sorry if I butcher her name, but I think it's pronounced Tomiko. At least her last name is McWilliams. And then let's go through some of her stats. So I haven't actually used her at all since the last time I recorded the video. So she is still using her weapons that came with her. As you guys can see, she has a RTX Horbreaker. And then of course the RTX Crusher, which I don't really use. I don't think I've ever used it actually. Most of the time I bring them back and then swap out their vehicle. So she does carry 30x rounds and some fire bombs. So those I guess are okay. Let's use one. Oh, okay. Complete waste. Oh, for a second, I thought she's gonna just come chase after me while be on fire. So now, let's go through her skills. I'm gonna go back into the house just because I don't want to get attacked by a zombie while I'm going through the menu. Now I'm gonna run to the top. Let's see. Alright, I think this is safe enough, right? We're like, no way they can get up here, can they? Alright, so as you guys can see, Tomigo is a Daybreak Operator. So, I think Daybreak Operator now has the newer backpacks as well. Because originally, if you guys remember, the Daybreak Operator tend to have the large hiking backpack. But it's like the, you know, Red Talent Special. It's quite large, but I think its weight's the same. So we already went through her items, and as you guys can see, she is not that strong at the moment, obviously. But we can go through her stats. Let's check out her skills first. Sorry. So her name is Tomiko McWilliams. I'm pretty sure Tomiko sounds very Japanese. And from the little picture on the right hand corner, she look Asian, so I'm assuming she's Japanese. But McWilliam is like a... I don't think that... <laughs> that doesn't even resemble any Asian name in general. So let's go through some of her skills. So let's see... Huh. Health and stamina. Not very high at the moment. And... Minus 7 McWilliam's many infestations. Oh, so that that could be easily clear. So it's not a big problem. And once she recruit, uh, once she reach hero level, I guess people don't really know me yet, but they will, huh? Leadership trailer. So hopefully I can get something out of it. I don't know what her hero skills at the moment is, but we'll see. And then this one is a lot of you guys are having trouble dealing with because all the red talent soldier comes with something bad. Like right now. Is sometimes waste food, which is I can deal with, plus a hundred percent food consumption per day. That means I gotta support one extra <laughs> units of food for her just per day. So she eats double what the other people eat, which is kind of crazy if you think about it. But then again, if you watch those old, you know, Jackie Chan movie, I don't know if you ever seen Asian people like they pack a lot, kind of like they eat a lot, like the hot dog eating champion guy. I don't think he I don't think he's a champion anymore. I think some other people beat him a while ago. But you guys know who I'm talking about, right? The super skinny Japanese guy that eats like a ridiculous amount. So I can deal with the food storage thing and looks like she has the regular downside for irritable towards other people, minus sixty six percent standing reward. So those are not big problems for me. Sometimes waste food, that's a bit odd for me. Now if I have to go calculate stuff out for her Right now I have 10 people and I probably will end up using more than 10 units of food but it's going to be a while because I do go out and collect food anyways. Well, I don't go out purposely and collect food but you know what I mean. So the standing, you know, the regular skills, you got cardio, tactic, fighting, war fighting and of course, ta-da, hacking. So this is the skill that I've been looking for for so long and I finally got it. I don't know if this is common for everyone, so if you guys have the same problem, because I know for a fact, some people, a lot of my viewers actually said that the hacker that they get also has plus 100% food consumption per day. So is that to all hackers? Let me know in the comment below. So how many of you guys have hackers and have this as a downside to them, their skills? So enough talking about him. Oh, sorry, her. Looks like she also have minus one back and then minus one, uh, 40% fatigue 
So that's good. Stat plus, uh, that doesn't really affect anything. That means I only get minus 56% instead. Alright, so let's go do some work. We're gonna, you know, equip Tamigo with some proper gears. Well, it's not like she doesn't have good gear. She has great gear. But I prefer to give her some actual weapons that I like to use. Gave her a little baseball swing right there. Wait, was that a zombie on the ground for a second? Am I going through a siege? Nope, we just got a group of zombies hanging around. Whoa, Rosenberg? I can't get out. Rosenberg, let me help you. What is going on just to see? Huh. That's odd. Okay, so Rosenberg, I think, took care of... Okay, that was not what I was hoping to do. Wait... Where is that? Barrel incoming. Ooh, ha. Someone covered me right there. Was it you? Was it you guys? Good start for Tomiko. Tomiko. Man, I'm gonna butcher her name one day or another. Okay. Alright. Let's go in. Go back to re equipping weapons. Okay. Get rid of this firebomb, some samples, let's put this weapon away. Equip couple extra rounds. I guess that should be plenty, right? Reload. Oh, that was fast reload there. I didn't even see her reload. That happens from time to time though, so not really surprising. Okay, now we got to... What weapon did we get to? I think we got to... Paran? I spy a screamer. Bowie Machete. I like Bowie Machete. I like the sound of Bowie Machete. Where is that screamer? Oh, what's up, buddy? Oh, what I need is a freaking suppressor on this baby here. Some of you guys might be wondering why do I even want a suppressor? Well, it's nice occasionally. Ah! <sighs> might not be the best fighter yet. You know, after getting used to killing so many zombies with my other high-level red talents, uh, her fighting skill is still on the low side. So, what we're gonna do is grab a can of fuel. Maybe some first aid kit just in case. Two, huh? Well, I don't blame her. She's still, I think, three stars on those carrying capacity skills. Okay. Uh, one sack of medicine. Huh, maybe I can just carry this medicine, just run around for level up. Yeah, supplies the river, whatever. Let's make some bowl plate here. Another one. Okay, let's go with that. I think that's good. Uh, let's make a couple extra rounds of bullets. I'm gonna get the boost boost okay that should be all good now I guess what I need to do is find out where can I go get another ammo outpost so this could be an ammo outpost down here so that would be my seventh or I don't think this is an ammo outpost yeah so that's not technically considered to be an ammo outpost so I can go over there and grab an ammo outpost and on the way I might as well just take out the two play card so that way I can get some extra points, you know, for Tomiko so she can level up to be a hero quickly. Now, let's get going. Uh, oh yeah, before I forget. I keep forgetting. One thing that I do kind of want is like a fast scroll down button. You know what I'm talking about? Change sort order. Hold on. Does that change anything? Wait, wait a second. Maybe that just put all my stuff on top, right? Please tell me that put all my... Nope. That did not change anything for the ammo-wise. Huh. I was hoping for all the mods to be jumping on top. Like, basically, you know, flip it upside down with all the storage and stuff. So I guess I just had to go through my long list of stuff. Of course, I know, I keep saying that I need to scrap a lot of my stuff. And I really do need to. As you guys can see, it takes me like a whole minute just to get from the top to the bottom. I'm sure a lot of you guys have the same problem. In fact, 
I'm sure a lot of you guys have worse than problem than me. I know a lot of you guys have a lot more weapon than I do. So you guys must have it a tough. All right, now let's get over to the first play cards. Might not be the best idea to take a rookie down into the play cart, but it shouldn't be that big a problem. I might need a firecracker, but we'll sh we shall see. I can always run away, right? Why is this play card seem so far? Oh, nope, I saw a bloater. Let's kill our way there. Let's see if Tamiko can handle some stress oh, from this work. Not exactly the best color. If you guys ever watched me using Pennington, well, I guess she's still newish. You know what I mean? Her fighting skill is not that high yet, so eventually she might get a lot better. The sword dance skill, I don't know if she has it, I haven't seen it yet. But bring it on guys, bring it on. Okay, let's take care of the float. Oh, what the? Is that a juggernaut in the background? That is a juggernaut in the background. There is a lot of zombie in the background over there. Stations are getting out of hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all know the infestation is getting out of hand, but there's nothing I can do at the moment. We're working our way there, okay? Okay. Hmm. Turning on the light for you guys. Anything helps, right? God, I am so sick of plague zombies. Well, you will see a lot of it. So, oh, can't see. All right. Looks like we're fighting our way around it. That's one more down. Another guy up there. Let's make sure I have enough bullets before I go in. I fucking hate Let's... play cards. Hey, you have never fought one. Oh, maybe you have. Just not with me, right? Wow, talk about the freaking amount of smoke or should I say fume? Like toxic plague fume? I don't see any more zombies near. What the? How are you not showing up on my radar? Stay in the car doesn't do much, does it? Someone just made us an offer. You should really hear that. Okay, looks like I maxed out that skill over there. Oh, and there's a bloater somewhere in this house. Sorry guys, I'm a little worried about that bloater. It's he's either sleeping or where is he? There he is. Oh look at that. He's actually taking a nap. Can I take it in his Nope. I thought I could shoot it in the thighs and still, you know, take him out without causing him to explode. Ah, there's one thing that is different about Tamiko compared to some of my other soldiers. She doesn't seem to be able to stop properly when she's attacking. But that could be just me not getting used to it yet. But of course, now her hero skill is going up. So hopefully that will mean she's more agile compared to some of my other ones. So what was going on over there? I feel like there was a couple missions that popped up while I was doing this. Uh... Hmm, see what they need help with. So these guys are the zombie veterans. They're like the leftover soldiers, 
previously, if you guys play this game early, early on when it's like barely released, you guys will see there's some like abandoned soldiers and like, you know, other stuff. That's how I kind of got Self, which is one of my other community members, uh, which is right there. A lot of you guys ask how I got someone like her. So if you're new, I think they took the Enclave, this, uh, this little group of Enclave out of the game. But if you had this game for a while, chances are you probably have someone like this. And if I remember correctly, one of the first characters that you actually play with should be a soldier. Uh, mine, I think it's called Piper, but sh I actually lost Piper to a bloater. I ran over a bloater while in a vehicle. Piper and one other person, and the doctor actually, is one of the first time I lost people. Well, I guess I lost one of my original characters too, and that was... Oh, I'm glad I didn't have to deal with that, because that would have been bad. Imagine if I ran across this baby here. It would have been so bad. I might have to, uh... Oh! Run! I saw him in the corner of my mini-map. <laughs> you want a piece of me? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. All right. That <laughs> pharaoh caught me. But I did catch that pharaoh off guard, too. He, I saw him running towards me in the me map. I did not hear him scream or any of those little roars until I saw the little icon on the mini map popping up, and I just hit circle, kind of like a reflex, you know, just to start rolling. Kind of like that's how I, how scared I am of those guys. And now I figure it's actually quite simple, but still, Pharaohs still scares me. Oh, uh, what was I thinking? What was I thinking? Trying to go uphill over here oh that was a bad crash that was a very very bad crash okay we're back at the base I think and there's a couple people in my base I think that wants my help or something but I do need to give her another weapon though that one break pretty easily. I thought the Bowie knife was better than this. If you guys ever saw Rambo, you know the movie. I love the Bowie knife that he uses. I'm here, by the way. Who am I talking to? You say I'm here, by the way, but who is I am here? Damn, I went through a lot of bullets with her. Okay. So who was that talking? You. Carla, what's up, Carla? You? My community found a way to weaponize bloater gas. Of course, of course. They're gonna ask me to take care of some bloaters. Most of the time, when we take care of bloaters, it go we go to a house, which makes sense. But the bloater, it, like they're stuck in the house, and when they come out, they trip themselves and they blow up, which is annoying if you think about it. Oh, I thought for sure I was going to get multiple zombies with those couple shots. Up, uh, nope, nope. Man. Okay, doing pretty well, I would say. Wait, hold on. Yep, I forgot a melee weapon. Melee weapon, melee weapon. Where can I get one? What weapon should I go with this time? Deposited the Bowie knife since it was damaged. And let's see, we got Bowie Knife, uh, I mean Carpenter X, I don't know about this one guys, it's just an axe, so I think I might skip this one, and let's go with something else, it's not even interesting, we got a lawnmower blade, so which is, what, what, oh her carrying capacity is pretty low at the moment, so she get tired pretty quickly, and seems like the lawnmower blade might be a bit heavy for her. So where is this blur gas house that I'm supposed to go to? Kill three bloaters. Where? Am I going crazy? Oh no, all the way down there to the warehouse where all the infestations are. Hmm. 
I should take one of my guys. No. Do I even have any blood rockers? You know what I'm talking about, right? To attract all the zombies. I don't think I have any blood rockers. Nope, I don't. I think I used it in the last siege. Well, I want it to be a siege, but it didn't work out that way. So let's go down there and just do some work. We're gonna kill three bloaters. Since they're in the warehouse. Ow. Okay, how am I doing on gas? Half tank. We're good. Record time, record time. Let's go down there. Hopefully I don't run into any uh <laughs> that was a oh I was about to say I don't run into any uh bloater but there was a bloater and a jug. I feel like I'm doing some crossroad racing. Oh whoa what is going on? My car is like stuck. Probably went the wrong way again. I think I did. Can I cut across? Well, I'm cutting across now. I think this is the route. This could be the route. Yep, I think it is. I think we're good. Dang, she's gonna become a hero no time at this rate. This little group of enclaves staying in this town like full of infestation. Alright, so obviously there's gonna be a lot of cars here. Just because, well, you know, my action hero car actually spawns around here. I wish we have like night vision, like actual night vision, not just Zed Eye or something like that. Why do I always find the ugly ones? I don't see anything. Where? One. I don't see any of them moving over there. That is so dark and I don't want to go in there yet. Because I know if I go near this guy, he's going to blow up on me. So that's one bloater. Sure taking his time to leak out all his gas. Could be worse. Eh, I guess it could be worse. Jeez. Aww. I just missed one of the bloaters. That's what I hate about it. Oh, there I can see his green eyes. I can see his green eyes. That makes two. Any more, any more. So, that's the annoying part when you do this mission. The bloater just kinda, like blows up. This one killed himself. I didn't even have to shoot him. But that doesn't count as one of my three. Oh, what in the world? There was no gas over here. How did that happen? The ga other gas is in there. So what in the world? Okay. So let's go find ourselves another bloater somewhere. There got to be a bloater around in this town. We're talking about look at all these infestations. Wait a second. There's another one inside the building according to it. Wait, huh? Done and done. Too easy. I've never seen a bloater nice. jump down like that before, guys. Like, that bloater jumped down off the little ledge and somehow it didn't blow up. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Huh. Hmm. She sounded pretty evil just now with the way she's laughing. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna go up there and see what these guys want. Looks like she's do Carla's doing work. Let's 
excuse me guys watch out sir man my car needs a car wash and a tune up doesn't sound very nice I can hear the little whine must be a piece of zombie brain stuck in my my belt okay hot fives all around what does that mean? Pretty good repair. Oh no, un unexpected breakages. Breakages. Oh. Coming through. Oh, my car is smoking. I wonder if I can make it there at this rate. <laughs> I might have to stop by an outpost just to get some repair kits. Oh. Oh, oh, I think I killed him. <laughs> that was an accident. I, I couldn't even see him. Alright, guys. My car is smoking a lot. A lot. Well, it looks like the speed is blowing off the smoke. So, when, you're, when you see your car smoking this game, drive faster. Alright, let's... <laughs> Let's repair this car actually. My this is my one of my babies. Can't stand this scene like this. Looks like we're looks like it's a like an off-road vehicle. Not off-road, what's much what am I talking about? Rally cross vehicle. Alright, let's drop these back. We do let's drop that off. Okay, where is my repair kit? One should be enough, but I'll bring two just in case. Alright. Let's see. Can you guys see the engine? What is that? Four bank? Is that a four cylinder? I won't be surprised if it's actually it's just four cylinder engine. It's not a it's not gonna be a V8, that's for sure. But I never know that. What if this is especially tuned for some kind of sport right before the zombie apocalypse happened? So this could be possibly a super sport of some sort. Okay, I, I'm gonna grab another tank of gas. Might as well. But I'm gonna leave this one in the back, actually. She, her carrying capacity is pretty low at this point. You know. <laughs> Just putting on that little blade caused her to get tired one earlier. Left. Okay. Zombie veterans, I'm coming. Uh, I'll avoid those. Me down. Wait, what in the world just happened? I just picked up a bag of ammo. Did I left this thing somewhere here? That's weird. Well, I guess that's a um, ple that's a pleasant surprise. I just came here and I picked up a bag of ammo. Who am I talking to? Who am I supposed to talk to? Stanton, you're the leader, right? We have been there on last home. Some of us didn't make it. We could use your help to recover something that we got left behind. Do you have a second? Hmm. Who is McNeil? I can't let you do this alone. Yeah, sure. You're in charge. Wait. McNeil, if he's coming with me, there's a chance that McNeil could be pretty depressed because his friends die in that house. And that means that this is one of the military people group that you can actually recruit. I don't know. Oh. Got some air there, got some air. But it's not gonna have the military outfit, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm just going through people's backyards. 
Come on, Mega Neo. Oh, I think that's one of your friends. That's for sure one of your friends. Because no regular zombie look like that. Shut up, Screamer. Looks like couple we already took care of his friends that was here. All three of them were out here. Okay. Let's search his friends. Now that's heavy. Wait, hold on. We don't need this. Small backpack, screwdriver. I don't need any of those. Okay, grab this. Grab that. I don't need the rest. One more person to search. So oh, you make noise. Execute, right? Okay. Oversized mallet. I guess that's the only thing that we'll want. Hey, I caught dips on this zombie. What are you doing, huh? What do you think you're doing? Running out of fuel. Wow, you're getting tired real fast. Damn it! I thought I could do this. I'm sorry. So McNeil is basically the press. This is gonna come in handy. Or sad because you know he saw his friends die. We're gonna have to go and look for that SSG or whatever. Hmm. Her searching skill is not that high yet, so I can't see through the walls of where all the items are. Nothing here. Oh, found a couple of searchables. No room. Okay, I need to drop some stuff off. McNeil, you better behave. Drop, drop. Mm, and drop. I might actually need to carry this baby and then put away my oversized melted over there. So that should be good. And that means I can carry. All over it. Oh, I think this is actually the one that will have the weapon. Recruit with McNeil before returning. Understood. Uh. Return the weapon to Stanton. Yep. So this is exactly the mission that self which is the army recruit that I got got like I did the exact same mission with self back in the day and that's how I recruited her so S Stanton or sorry McNeil is gonna be kind of you know shocked or sad that we had to kill their own friends and later on you will have chance to recruit them so they are the leftover veterans it's basically the same people as self but unfortunately their weapons are no long I mean their outfits are no longer the same yo 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 you want a piece of me that's what I thought okay I gotta see if there's a skill that I need to level up oh not yet looks like I still got a little while to go before that but no worries there let's go we're gonna go back to Stanton and drop off that gun for him. I hope they don't get pissed. My community, that is. I feel like it, even though I'm returning a weapon that doesn't belong to us in the first place, they still get pissed. They could. There's a chance. Knowing them, they could be like, why did you return the weapon that they asked us to find that belonged to their friend? Why? You should have kept it. Almost crashed into that mini pool there. Good to see you. Yeah, this is bad, but it doesn't change our mission. Yeah. Yeah, Stanton. Yeah. Let's see what you got. Business partner. Sure. Oh, okay. So they got the same. Oh, nope, not the same gun. I thought for some reason I thought it was the same gun that I gave them. All right, let's get back down into that my outpost over here so I can drop some of these stuff off and maybe I can go take out that last play card that's on the map it should be the last one I hope and then we could also go claim that outpost down there
juggernaut, juggernaut, juggernaut. Crash into the police office. Yeah. What? That was maxed out already. That was quick. I think it's one of the skill that came upgraded, actually. Alright, let's drop all these things off. Let me just carry this and run with it so I can get level up on the backpacking skill. Don't worry, I'm not gonna put back the gas. Just because I know I'll need it eventually. All these are probably gonna go straight to scrap once I start scrapping stuff. Alright, now, play hard time. I don't think I have any, what do you call it, firecracker with me? Uh, that is not happening. I was trying to see if I can cut across the mountain, but... That was a big group of infested zombies, why would they be wanting it here? There's no Plagar here anymore. Oh. Watch out guys, watch out! Oh, my bad. Sorry dude. My bad. Oh, are these guys just dead? Oh, they are dead. For some reason, I thought they were alive just laying around the ground. Ooh, my bad. Oh. Okay. I feel like Zombie Land right now. What's that guy's name? That just kills Zombie for fun. Like, you know, he just opens the door all the time. I feel like... I feel like him right now. What is his name? You trying to get zombie killer of the week or whatever the number of the day or whatever it is. I think this is a possible shortcut, right? Well, I actually have made it worse by going off-roading when there's a nice paved smooth road over here. Just want to make sure there's no bloater hanging around here and I just run into him at full speed. We're sure this is the last one, right? Because I don't want to do this again. Okay, so I don't get tired too quickly. We're going to put these heavy stuff in there. I don't see that many zombies. Oh, I, just kidding. I take it back. I take it back. One. Two, three, oh, what? Four, five, six. Ooh, can I get multiple zombies? I think I did. I got two of them. And I miss. Just gotta make sure I keep an eye on my mini map there. Last time I do this, a pharaoh came at me. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to get two of them. There was a bloater, I think, that caught my eye right there. Ha. Huh. Oh, I thought I got him for sure, but whatever. Okay, there doesn't seem to have much zombie left. So, Look what I, I can do... The last plague heart in town. Yep, yep. Let's go in and do some work. Oh, it seems like there's a group of zombies behind it. Actually, let's take care of that. Is that what they're looking at for the group of zombies? Ooh, I missed like crazy. Can not see all these? Oh, I can see, but I'm missing like crazy. Is that it? Nope. Is that it now? I think that's it. Okay, let's do this. Reload. Fuck you up. Put in the burst round. Not dead yet. There's another couple zombies hanging around. I'm gonna take care of them before. Gotta kill that screamer. 
Where? Where is that streamer? It's gonna be a while before they can bust in. Yeah. There was a lot of zombie coming in those doors for a second. Of course, of course. All right. Look at the contribution she's doing. I mean, she's joining in the community, right? And she took out two plague hearts. And one of them just happened to be the last. She did some mission, help out the leftover zombie veterans. You know, she's just doing work, guys. Oh, it's not much. That's a lot of stuff. Come on, come on. You know that is not a lot of stuff. You should be able to carry like a billion pounds. Oh, okay, maybe not a billion. Let's say 500,000. Well, Dang. could have been louder. Okay, okay. Bring it on. Look at that. She's getting better with the blade. But she's getting tired real quickly. Okay, seems like there's a lot of plague sample just hanging around. You guys can see all those little red dots, but we did it. We actually erased the blood plague from our town. Not exactly in a hurry for that. So let's go there and claim my last outpost. <laughs> Funny how I'm gonna claim my last outpost the moment I finish you know, cleaning out the town. Hmm, maybe this is not the best way. This is the fastest way. Wa bam. Excuse me guys, watch out. I never got to bring that car back over there, the black Moragan NT. Probably I probably won't get it just because I have a red and an orange one. In real life, I prefer a black car for sure, but... So I do have the mechanics. If you guys remember, I helped out a group, the mechanics, but they just disappear. Because I was actually just wondering about that earlier. Because I was driving up on that corner, and the mechanics are gone. Like, do they just disappear or what? Because I know we didn't go, we didn't kill them. We helped them out. And did I maybe forget to help them out and they moved or something? Okay, last outpost guys, last outpost, Tenny speaking my 7th outpost, my first official claim of the 7th outpost. outpost done. You can consider this outpost done anytime you want. Okay, I think I'm gonna put these baby in there. Damn it. It's... My last one. Trust me, you have a lot back at base. Yes, cardio's maxed out. What do you guys think? Why do zombies travel in groups? Looks like we got all of our outposts. I mean, I admit this one's really close. I wish this one would have been like right over here. And then this one would have been like over here. And then this one could stay here. You know, so that way I have like a pretty even all over the place. But the ammo outposts never lay out that good. Wait, was that a zombie? I just heard a zombie or something. Okay, let's go home. Let's go home, guys. Time to go home. It says a new beginning. Well, when they say new beginning, it's like, go home and tell people we kill all the zombies. Oh, not. Not all the zombies. I mean, like, all the play hearts. If you kill all the zombies in this game, I wouldn't be making a video on it anymore. How much? How much more? Do you guys think she's a hero already or not yet? Probably still a little bit shy of being a hero. But who knows? Maybe by the end of this drive with all these zombies that I'm killing on my door, I might be able to make her a hero.
some of you guys are right here. I know you guys are on Church on the Hill. I actually debated whether I should move there or the corner office just because, you know, it's the Church on the Hill is literally like dead center on the map. But the corner office just has a lot more around it. I would say like all the, you know, supplies. There's more going on around it. Church on the Hill is nice, but this is better. I'm gonna park my. Oh, dang it! it! Got me excited. I don't know if you guys saw it earlier, but that gate was open for a second <laughs> until it decides to magically, you know, respawn again. So there's that. Well, I can only. Oh, uh, I can fit two. I know I can fit two, but I don't want to squeeze it. So we're gonna put this baby in here, pretending like it's being fixed. Actually, just one car is like cramped. Okay, more parts. That's okay. Probably tomorrow I'm gonna walk out of my base. I'm gonna be like, oh my god, what is going on? What happened to my car? Okay, nothing really. You figure like you come to a mechanic's garage, you think that there's gonna be some kind of a repair kit or something. Did I get him? I got him. Right before he got in, I got him. I'm home and not dead. My two favorite things. Yeah. Okay. Let's see where she stands at the moment. So, halfway there. She is not hero yet, but she's, I would say, what? 40%? So, let's power this up. Heck yes. Now, I don't have to worry about most of these stuff. All of them will maxed out eventually. But looks like she's doing really well. So guys, I'll end it right here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel. It'll be a huge help. While you're at it, check out some other videos. And I'll see you guys next time.